The magistrate court sitting in Lokoja has granted the four suspects, Shadu of Revu, Abara Ismaila, Yakub Ochu, and Abdurrahman Badams, charged for destabilizing the just concluded Adavi House of Assembly PDP primary elections, including attempted murder, threats of life, and assault on Sadiq Hassan and others. They were therefore granted bail upon their appearance in court for the second hearing. The court rules that the former and present House of Representative member be present on the 29th August, which is the adjoined date for further hearings. Our reporter, Faith Abdogafar, will cover the proceedings as more. On the 28th July, they first brought the case of Sheho Overuvo and three others charged for attack on supporters of one of the aspirants for Adawi PDP House of Assembly on the just concluded primary election. Head of Community Secondary School, Ogaminana, in Adawi local government area of Kogi State. The suspects were formally arranged on three accounts of charges verified by the Ministry of Justice. All the suspects were granted bail. They were subsequently taken on bail by shorties. Former House of Assembly member with landed property within the jurisdiction of the court. The lawyer representing the nominal complainant, Abdulazak Tijani Ahmed, is optimistic that justice shall prevail in the end. One novelty, interestingly, that came up is the issue of whether uh, if the Ministry of Justice is prosecuting a matter, whether there is need for a private counsel to watch, continue to watch brief of the nominal complainant. And the court equally agreed with our position that there is nothing in Section 211 of the Constitution that bars a private practitioner from watching brief while the case is going on, even if the Ministry of Justice is the one handling it. Because all the functions elicited uh, under that provision, there is none that is in conflict with the council are watching brief, so you cannot take away what is not taken in the first place. So there was never none of the right of the AG is being uh, exercised by the private council watching the brief of the nominal complainant, and so there was nothing to take away. And the court they, they, they agree with us, nothing at all to take away. We are not part of that. Uh, they are granted bail. We feel the law will take its course at the right time, but we are happy because at least the standard of uh, the persons expected to act as shorties and not just uh, nobody. He said the suspect pleaded not guilty after their arrangement and the case was adjourned to 29th and 30th of August. Ahmed urged youth to shun criminal acts and advised them to stay away from Togri during the forthcoming general election 2023. I'm sad about the political events. And I feel I want to use the opportunity to say this. The next round of, uh, of uh, amendment of the Electoral Act should carry this. Political parties should be made to act in accordance with their manifesto so that the issue of that contract can be fulfilled. If I'm voting for you because of so 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 thing, I should expect to get so so thing. And they can go further by making it actionable that if the party haven't won an election goes against the manifesto, you can actually take them to court. Sorry, we cannot do. We cannot do. We cannot do anything criminally defined as a crime and uh, just go scot free. If not, society will become a banana republic where anybody can just wake up and uh, either kill you and continue to walk on the streets. So that's why we're here. The victim who spoke to journalists said the action of the suspect were attempted culpable homicide, amongst others. They describe it as an assault on PDP. When they reached the venue, what we heard from their leaders, which is my brother, was chase them, chase them. And they started throwing stones on us. And everybody has to run for their safety. Fortunately, I was um, with uh, my leader that had been injured and one other person that was caught in the, in the hand. By the same person, they ceased from taking law into their hands and let us do the good job. We knew what is good for us to do and what is bad that we're supposed to be deviated from. But unfortunately, 
I wonder why some people choose to do bad instead of good. So I personally, there's no you can use me for a togre because I believe whatever position you are today, it can I can take this the same position. If you want that even more than that tomorrow because of my little knowledge and my exposure. So I advise the PDP National Secretariat to swing action into this uh, issue because we don't want our great party to lose. But I mean, this other group that I mean, we complain, complain of who involved Togri to come and harm me. It's not only harm me, they wanted to eliminate my life. As old as I am, they used my chat on me. There was no election, primary election. The next thing we see was stones, most of them holding matches. That what chased them from their leaders, they started chasing us. We were running helter skelter in, this, in, this, in, that, in that venue. We are not going for farming, we are not going to, for hunting. Because of man being, you put matches in the vehicle and you use the matches on somebody's head. So by whisker, the, 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 our, that our leader survived it. That was an attempted murder. I'm even surprised with the charges that is being read here now. But however, the law will take its course. They further charged the state party chairman and other members of the state executives to up their game in building a strong party devoid of bitterness. To God, up to now, we don't even know what the state chairman is doing in this, uh, in this party, in the state. Even, it is even like we don't have state chairman because we've not seen him in any PDP activities that we've been doing. So, and so, on and so on. We, don't, we don't know whether they are state chairman because since that time up to now, nothing has been said in this issue by the party. Show up. They did not show up. No Nobody has showed up. They believe they can do and undo. So that's why we believe justice should prevail. prevail in this matter so that it should serve as a lesson to the kind of leaders that believe they should go on talk with politics and the kind of youth that believe they should be using them marvelously so that we, uh, we correct ourselves. PDP need overhauling, especially in, the, in Kogi, uh, in the local government and Kogi as a whole. We, we, they need overhauling and without doing it, oh, it's, it's most unfortunate. They, this is not the way to handle the party. They advised supporters of politicians especially youths, not to allow themselves to be used as a tools of destruction. St. Togri does not pay. Faith Abdul Ghaffar reporting for MLC TV News.